Now, if there's one thing that I've learned in this journey, it's set realistic goals. Um, what's made me fail in the past is time and time and again, I would try to do everything at once. I would give up porn, weed, alcohol, sugar, and as soon as I would break, so for example, as soon as I would watch porn, it would lead to me relapsing on other aspects as well. So I would watch porn, then I would have a beer, then I would, you know, go buy some weed, then I would just binge eat and watch TV and, and watch some more porn. And that cycle would go on for days, um, sometimes weeks and even months, only for me to hit rock bottom and realize that I need to get sober once again. Now, what I did differently this time is I, I decided to only give up weed and alcohol because truthfully, my, my addictions and my struggles with porn are, are much stronger. And I, knowing myself, I, I believe that I could go, go an entire year without weed and alcohol. And the reason why I'm talking about this is because I'm trying to adopt these same methods for me right now as I try to limit the amount of time I spend behind a screen. Um, because I'm struggling. Um, I, I, I struggle a lot with, with being addicted to always constantly needing some sort of screen time. And what I realized is that I can't cut out TV altogether. So instead what I told myself was, okay, Let's focus on mastering part of the day, which is the morning time. So anytime there is an AM, or anytime it's considered the AM, we're gonna be on. So anytime the clock is in the AM, um, I need to be productive in one way or another, whether it's sleeping, eating healthy, working out, cleaning, doing work, and as soon as it hits the PM, so as soon as it hits 12 PM, that's when I can go ahead and let my body kind of just relax. The goal is to just really focus on getting control of the morning. And then as time passes by, kind of slowly take control of the evening, 30 minutes at a time, hopefully leading for, for me to take control of the entire day. Now, one thing that I do know is that I can't be super strict with myself. I can't just give things up altogether. Uh, I need to be reasonable. I need to learn how to negotiate with myself and allow myself some moments of relaxation and downtime. Uh, because if I'm just trying to grind, I'm just gonna burn out and end up messing up. So there needs to be some sort of fine balance. But all I know right now is I am able to have some sort of, all I know right now is I, I have the willpower to, to control part of the day, the morning time. The morning is, is, is something that I've always been really good at and it's something that I was successful with this morning. I woke up, I went to the gym, I came back, I ate a healthy breakfast and then for the next couple of hours I was just work, work, working and then I ate some lunch and then next thing you know, it was 12 o'clock and that's when I told myself, okay, we can go ahead and just take our foot off the gas pedal and let ourselves relax. And that's what, that's what we're going to do. We're going to continue to go ahead and do this because I know for knowing myself, I can't just cut out all sort of screen time cold turkey and we'll see how this plays out. and kind of just document the journey and show the world how it plays. Peace. Wow. Wow, wow. I messed up so many times recording this today. Like, so many times. It's very hard to get my own thoughts communicated. It's so hard to communicate my own thoughts, and that's something I really want to learn how to develop. Um, that's a skill that I really want to learn how to better develop and that's something I hope to improve upon and see in my videos as I continue to do so. Until next time, good night, peace.